A big thank you to Squarespace for sponsoring this video and helping us manage our online shop, but more on that later. So today we're filming our third in our Super 8 film camera series. We are up in New Hampshire and we're gonna have a very cozy day and I wanna use the Super 8 camera the way that I feel like most people used it when they had it for just like classic home video footage. And so we have our Kodak Vision 3, the Super 8, and it's 50D, so it's like good for outside. But it's gonna be a really fun day. We're gonna just do cozy things. We're gonna make pizza, build a fire, go on a hike, maybe make muffins if we get crazy. And yeah, I think it'll be super fun because our friend Ashling is here with us today. And so, <laughs> we have three people, Lou, me, and Ashling, and hopefully we can kind of swap the camera through all day, all both of these cameras, and get a lot of different perspectives. And so it'll be cool to see who shoots what, what people see, and how having different perspectives changes the way that you use a Super 8 camera. You wanna build a fire? Mm-hmm. And action. Yes! <laughs> that was awesome. <laughs> so smooth. <laughs> What's this contraption you have, Lou? <laughs> it's a log splitter, but I'm not very good at using it yet. Oh. That's a beautiful fire you built. It was like, uh, yeah, a little bit. You're an old lady, I'm an old lady, I'm in now. that movement. <laughs> what do you think oh. of Super 8, Dana? It's so much fun. I just like love the fact that you like take it, you're in the moment, you just take whatever and then it's done and you can't like look back to be like, oh, that was stupid or it didn't work. It's like, eh, we'll find out later.
since this is the third time I've used this camera and I feel I'm actually getting a lot more comfortable with it. I'm getting things in focus way more than the first time I did it. I didn't really understand that I could like zoom in, get my rack my focus there and then zoom back out the way I wanted. So I feel like that is a really nice improvement that I feel comfortable with the camera. The only issue I've been having today is that since we've been shooting inside a lot more than any of the other times I've used it, we're having an issue with getting things like bright enough. And so I actually, I'm kind of curious, we don't have much left on this roll. So I kind of want to finish this roll and then switch to the other roll that we have, which is built better for like, it's set more for nighttime and see if that works better on the inside so that we can like, film making pizza and hanging out and knitting and playing cards maybe and to see what the difference between the two is one's 50 and one's 500 and i feel like super eight my experience so far has just been outside so it'll be really fun to see what it's like shooting inside and at night but first let's make lou go in the river and get a little you know fun entertainment out of it yeah <laughs> Woo, do you have some singles <laughs> 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 ah, Lou, it's over. It's all the footage I can take. <laughs> Get out. <laughs> it's freezing. Oh, you did So we're gonna go on to this one now, which is 500T Super 8, also Kodak, um, color negative film. Um, I've actually never shot with this kind before, but it's better for nighttime because, well, technically what, it's a higher ISO. So let's you shoot in a darker environment. And so it should be really fun. Ta-da, so let's see. Oh, cool. Yeah, the light meter says it's fine to shoot in here. Oh, yeah, it's way brighter. Yeah, that's awesome. Shall we make pizza? Mm-hmm. Kids, don't try this at home. So I thought that the 500 would work much better in low light situations, but unfortunately it's gotten too dark. And so I think that this roll of film, we are gonna have to shoot a different time, but the pizza is coming along great. We are gonna get the pizza out of the oven. We've got vegan barbecue, or no, what is it called? Vegan buffalo cauliflower. That looks amazing. Pizza is in the oven. And we'll have a beautiful dinner. We just won't be able to film it on this. So I think we'll show you the pizza when it comes out of the oven and then call it a night. Thank you for watching. This has been a super fun video to make. Thank you, Ashley, for joining us. And I hope that you enjoy it. And I really hope that this footage turns out well. As we dig into this pizza, I'd like to thank Squarespace for sponsoring this video and allowing us to get creative with Super 8 film. We love that Squarespace has a modern design, gorgeous templates, and that our site works seamlessly across a range of devices. So we can focus on the good things in life, like cozy nights by the fire. So head to squarespace.com slash wildlyroom for a free trial and you'll save 10% off your first purchase of a website or domain. See you next week.